You're also working on the album coming up. Yes. When did you decide to make that finally happen, and what can you tell us about that? We, uh, so, you know, working on the music for the show is a great pleasure, and it's been so nice that people have responded to it, and it's something that people talk about online and seem to be interested in, and so it seemed reasonably um, just considerate and nice to, to put it out there. You know, it's not, we're not trying to make money or anything, but just to, to gather yeah, this mean, stuff up. Yeah, we the money, <laughs> yeah. and they give it to us. Yeah, but it's not a, uh, it's not necessarily going to be a, you know, a, a gold record, but it doesn't, you know, for us, I don't it's just about. I you're saying that. All right, maybe it'll go platinum. You don't know these things. <laughs> we are, uh, you know, basically just going to put it out on iTunes. 20th, uh, you know, Century Fox was interested in it and was excited about it. They were glad that the music caught on. Obviously, they have these, you know, monster music machines like Glee. There's and, a space on Lauren's shelf that has been empty. He's, I say, why don't you put something there? He's like, that's where the Grammy goes. <laughs> so. If they gave Grammys for a 15 second long song, yes. we would win. This album is going to be like the happy feet of next year. <laughs> You know what I'm Did that about? win? Or? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but it's Pharaoh, Pharaoh Williams' song. Oh, like yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Everybody's yes. into it. Yes. Yeah. He yeah. cried on Oprah Winfrey. Did not? I missed it. <laughs> 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 he cried on Oprah Winfrey. Yeah, You're going to cry on Oprah Winfrey. I can't wait. I can't wait. <laughs> it's better when he does it, probably, but I'll try. I'd love to see you cry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bob's Burgers comic book coming out. Did I say that? Oh, no. no. Pa uh, uh, Dynamite. Great. Do you know them? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they do a lot of you know, really good adaptations. Do they? Yes, they do. They do, they do good work. Really good. good. Okay, good. Yeah, they've been very disappointed with us at our speed, our slowness. <laughs> um, oh, so you're the, you're yes. They're writing okay. it. We're writing. When's it coming out? Uh, this spring or summer. I assume they're trying this to get one? it. Yeah. So That's now. Yeah, right, because it's now. Yeah, right. You now, just said now. Right. Now. Now. now the future that you're living in. Yeah, right. I right. really love right. it. Right. <laughs> yeah, in the future, it's already out. Oh, wow. Yeah. It did okay. <laughs> well, is, it, is it a one shot or going to be? No, uh, we've, we're contracted for five issues. I assume that's not the goal. Like, that, you know, they want to see how those will do, and then we would do more. But it's very hard to do. I mean, it's hard to do the show and the comic book at the same time, but it's fun. Do they kind of coexist in the same world? Or are you going to be referencing things that happen in the comics on the show? We're, tr we're not doing a particularly um, stretched narrative. It's more like little bits and bobs. So you, you don't necessarily have a, a, um, a long story arc that we then have to worry about on the show. Like, oh, God, we, you know, that guy you know, moved away in the comic book, so now we can't, so it's, it's more, you know, did you see that Fraud Files episode where each kid told their story? Yes. It's a little more like that. Each character kind of has a little section of the comic book. Cool. Could yeah. you use some of the comic book for an episode? Yeah. That's yeah. Nice. Well, you could for for the fraud files type episodes. Like it's pretty fun. We you know we make it right. in Louise's voice, for example. So it leaves the reality. It's a story she's telling I see. I see. in which you you know it's a little less grounded. Yeah. Which, but it's fun because it's coming from her. It's like Louise's unsolved mysteries and curious curiosities is her little section. Oh, that's cool. No, yeah. I was just wondering if you were burning really good ideas for episodes. <laughs> right. That was my favorite one. Yeah. yeah. I mean, because there's only like a four or five a year. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, I know, yeah. Yeah, yeah, And Tina's section is, um, of course, Tina's erotic friend fiction. <laughs> the comic book.